Hello students, welcome to Teach You Smart. Today, we are going to open up a new topic, visualizing solid shapes. Let's see some objects. Clearly we can say that these objects have length, width, and height. And they need space to occupy. These shapes are called solid shapes or 3D shapes. Some common examples of solid shapes are cube, sphere, cone, cylinder, and pyramid. Let's see some elements of a 3D shape. Each solid shape has unique characteristics that define it. Such as the number of faces, vertices, and edges, we need to understand what is a face, what is a vertex, and what is an edge. We can explain these elements by taking a cube. In the cube, we can see some flat surfaces. These flat surfaces are called faces. That is, faces are the flat surfaces of a solid shape. When two faces meet, we get a line segment called an edge of the cube. That is, edges are the lines where two faces meet. And a point where two or more edges meet together is called a vertex or corner of the cube. So vertices are the points where the edges meet. That is, a cube is a 3D shape with flat faces, straight edges, and sharp vertices. Such shapes are called polyhedrons. That is, a three-dimensional shape with flat polygonal faces, straight edges, and sharp corners or vertices called a polyhedron. Each polyhedron has a unique set of vertices, edges, and faces. Now, can you classify these shapes as polyhedrons and non-polyhedrons? Yes, let's see. Figure 1 shows a cuboid with flat faces, straight edges and sharp vertices. So the cuboid is a polyhedron. Figure 2 shows a cone which has two surfaces, one is a flat surface, but the other is a curved surface, and it has no straight edges. So, cone is not a polyhedron. Figure 3 shows a prism, which has flat surfaces, straight edges, and sharp vertices. So, prism is a polyhedron. And figure 4, a cylinder having two flat surfaces and one curved surface and it has no straight edges and sharp vertices therefore it is not a polyhedron now let's see the classification of polyhedron they are convex polyhedron and concave polyhedron regular polyhedron and irregular polyhedron Let's have a comparison between convex polyhedron and concave polyhedron. In a polyhedron, if a line segment connecting two points on its surface lies completely within the polyhedron, then it is called a convex polyhedron. While in a polyhedron, if a line segment connecting two points on its surface does not lies completely within the polyhedron, then it is called a concave polyhedron. Now let's look at regular and irregular polyhedron. If the faces of a polyhedron are made up of regular polygons, and the same number of faces meet at each vertex, then it is called a regular polyhedron. But in this figure, all faces are regular, but the vertices, are not formed by the same number of faces. That is, three faces meet at A, but four faces meet at B. 
so it is not a regular polyhedron and we call it an irregular polyhedron let's recall what we discussed today today we discussed the elements of a 3d shape such as the face vertex edge polyhedron convex polyhedron and concave polyhedron regular polyhedron and irregular polyhedron before winding up let's check how much you understood by doing an activity identify which of the following are regular polyhedron That's all for now, see you all in the next class, with another interesting topic.